Metz from uh, the, what we'll call the Race to Beat Cancer, because right. that's what we're, uh, we're talking yes. about today. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yep. Kathy, how are you? I'm well, thank you. Thanks for having me. Well, th I'm glad you could be here. So you've got the big event coming up. We do. A couple weeks away, two weeks from today, the Race to Beat Cancer. It's Hope on the Slopes Race to Beat Cancer. Uh, it's part of a larger Hope on the Slopes event group from the American Cancer Society. Events taking place at mountains all across the United States. So we've uh, joined them, but this is our 36th annual wow, event. Wow, so can I ask that question? Yes, 36, 36 years. 36 years. So it's, it's quite got nice, long uh, history to it. Many people involved in the Valley over the years. And it's just a great fun event for people to get out and help support the American Cancer Society in our fight against cancer. Well, that's terrific. And, and it's a pretty... I don't want to say an easy format, but it really is. It's it's a fun format. So it is. what do people do? It to is. It's a fun run, and you know a lot of people go, "Oh, I don't race." And um, number one, if you don't ski or board, you can tube. So you, that's a cool. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. if you want to get out and have fun, you can do that. You don't have to be a, a skier. But um, if you are a skier and you're nervous about racing, it's very mellow. Um, it's just get out and have fun. It's the NASTAR course, which is the Meister course for people locally. Um, and we categorize by age and by gender. So you race against hopefully similar folks. And we give out prizes for the top three at our awards ceremony. And it's just a really fun day. And it's just to raise awareness and raise funds for the American Cancer Society. And uh, last year, you, you did very well with the race. We did. Event. We did. We did uh, over $18,000, which was uh, the biggest event since since I've been involved for yeah. eight years. So, yeah, we were very pleased. So it would be nice to get 20 this year. I'd be very excited. There you go. Yeah. Set those goals. That's right. i got to go. got to shoot for the stars. Now, if somebody wants to participate, what's, uh, what's the first step for them? Well, they can register online at cancer.org slash race to beat cancer. Um, and then when you get to that landing page, they call it click, and you'll get through the 2000 13 site where you can register as a participant. Um, we ask a $75 minimum for an adult, 50 for 17 and under, and you'll get a full day ski pass or a two hour tubing pass. You'll also get to have our lunch courtesy of Flatbread Company here in North Conway, who's our sponsor. And we have, as I said, an awards ceremony at one. And then we also have a wonderful raffle, many, many donations from terrific businesses throughout the valley as oh, well. Oh, that's so great. That's the kind of highlight. Everyone's hanging on to their tickets, seeing what they're going to win. So exactly. It's great. And I saw a picture in the paper the other day. You had a picture of the, the three top fundraisers. Mm -hmm. That's right. So that's kind of exciting for them. Yes, and our top, I mean, it's a fundraising event. So 75 is the minimum for an adult, but, you know, we've got a few people people that raise over a thousand, two thousand dollars um, pretty consistently, some of them. They're always in, they're vying in the top three. Yep. Um, we have, uh, for the top fundraiser, we have Cranmore is kind enough um, to donate a season's pass for next year. So that's always the big prize. Yep. And then we're working on maybe a pair of skis for another option. We're trying. And then we usually have a very nice third gift for someone to yep. choose from. So. It, it's a um, very good uh, incentive. Exactly. It, you know, also just to help us in, in our fight, but you know, yep. to get a little and, uh, back. And Hans is trying to pull up the website there. There it is. So uh, there there's is. the website yep. that you mentioned. Yeah. And uh, there's a picture right there of your top three fundraisers, yeah, right? Yeah, right there on yeah, the page. Yeah. And then you can click through and you can do everything online. And you can also fundraise online because if you, if you register online, you create your own Facebook, uh, not Facebook page, but uh, website that you can send out emails from. You can put a picture of yourself or maybe perhaps who you're racing in honor or in memory of. Yep. Um, and tell your story, send it out. People are always very more, uh, much more willing to give if you put your personal reason why you're participating oh, sure. in one of our events. Um, so that's important. But if you just want to wake up that day and show up, we're happy to have you. Many people just come in with, um, we've got these brochures you can pick up at Cranmore. Few of them have been left here and there around town as well, but if you want one, you can um, stop at Cranmore, you can call me, I'll get you one, or they can be downloaded on the website as yeah. well. And, uh, and like you say, it's just it's a great, fun event. It is. And uh, so you've been involved for eight years, I but. Have. Yeah. And has it been at Cranmore all those eight years? Or did, it did has, as long as I've been involved. And, I, and I'm not quite sure how long it's been at Cranmore. I, I know it was at Black. I mean, it's been 36 years. So. Right. So, it, so it did start, I think, at Black Mountain. Don't know when or why it changed. And I think it might have even been at Atatash. But I know it's been at Cranmore for a for number a of years. Now, and they're yeah. huge supporters. And we very much want to thank Ben and uh, Kathy, who is... Who is uh, <laughs> moving on but yeah. she's been great and Jillian and, and all the people that cr at Cranmore that help us Danbo every year doing the timing and 
Um, it's a wonderful, we couldn't do it. I mean, granted, you couldn't do a ski race without a mountain, but <laughs> they do so much for us yep. and they support us, um, you know, everything from helping us with the posters to, you know, uh, like, like I said, the facility itself. The, the donation, the tickets, everything they yeah. do for us, it's wonderful. And you know, you see people walking around who are involved in the event, they're, you know, they're having a good time, they know that they're raising money, mm -hmm. um, so it's, just a, it's a feel good time. It so. is, it is. And so that is happening on? Sunday, February 10th. Sub Sunday, um, February 10th. We open our registration at 8.30 in the morning, we're open, we, and then around quarter of 10 we close it. Racing is from 10 to noon, you get to take a couple runs when you're skiing. The tubers ski, uh, excuse me, the tubers race, right? At, 10 o'clock, yep. take a couple of timed, old-fashioned timing runs, you know, with uh, stopwatches, and then they come back for lunch and awards, and it's, it's just a great fun day. That sounds great. Yeah. And uh, so again, go to cancer.org. Slash more. race to beat cancer. Slash race to beat cancer. Get all the information you need, sign up, and be a participant. Yeah, come on out. We'd love to have you. That's great. Well, Kathy, thanks so much for joining us. Thank you. And uh, good luck this year with this race, uh, and hopefully everybody out there is going to participate. So we'll be back in a minute here on White Mountains Today. It's Meister time on White Mountains TV 6.